I guess the first thing I should say is, um, if you're watching this on YouTube, hello. Uh, this is a bit awkward to say live, but um, if you're watching this on YouTube, this was recorded live on Twitch. Um, I'm streaming right now as of recording this, not right now as of you watching it. But if you're interested, come check out my Twitch. Here's the book. I mean, here's the book. <laughs> so the book we're going to be talking about today is Welcome to the Universe, A Visual Tour in 3D by Neil deGrasse Tyson. It's actually by a whole bunch of people. Neil deGrasse Tyson, Michael A. Strauss, J. Richard Gott, and Robert J. Vander... Vander Bay? Vander B? Robert J. Vander B. We'll go with that. It's basically what it says on the tin. The in 3D bit is referring to this. Let me show. Look how cool this is. So it's got um, some goggles. These are little lenses. I wonder. Oh, wow. You can actually see it <laughs> magnify my eye through the. <laughs> and in the book, there are these pictures. So there's these pictures and they are at slightly different angles. And the idea is that using you basically hold the book like this, right? And so you got the picture on one side and the lenses on the other. And you can look through the lenses and view the pictures in 3D. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be able to show you that on camera. But I will say it can be a bit tricky at first to, like, figure out it's sort of a soft focus thing. It's like um, magic eyes. They're called magic eyes. Um, and they're basically images that if you soft focus on, it makes it look like there's a 3D image. Uh, it's a similar sort of thing with this book where you sort of do a soft long focus so you it's almost like you're looking at something that's like 10 feet away but then when you do that it creates a 3d image that is very very clear i will say that it's very cool i will say it's very cool um that is definitely not the original reason why i bought the book or anything like that but then let's talk about the actual you know the actual content of the book wouldn't that be um, something worth talking about. This is a book review after all. Besides the 3D, you have the Welcome to the Universe of Visual Tour part, which is essentially the book works its way through the universe. It starts with um, basically images of Earth, and then it works its way away from Earth. Each page, so example, uh, here is the moon. The book is... Um, laid out like this which i think is a bit weird so like as opposed to opening like this it's it's like this um uh, but that's kind of required for the whole lens thing uh but you can see here uh moon 1.3 light seconds so it works its way out into the universe uh by distance so it goes to the moon and then it talks about well roughly by distance then they talk about the sun then they talk about all the different planets work its way further further out and then it talks about like stars and different galaxies further and further away eventually ending with the cosmic microwave background very interesting how they do that um so it is very much like it says on the cover a tour and that was something that i was thinking about um while i was reading it is like if you're the kind of person who wants like maybe a super duper in-depth book this probably isn't it but if you do want, like, an overview of everything from here to as far out as we can see um, in a digestible medium, this is probably the, uh, the way you want to go. For me, who doesn't read a lot of things about space, uh, this was very entertaining. And you can see each image, it's just typically one to two paragraphs of, um, of a caption for each image. I mean, there are, I think, roughly, let me see if we can do the math here, roughly 70 uh, different images in the book, and then each book, uh, each image, rather, has its caption. Certainly not, like I said, anything particularly in detail, but it covers, it covers a lot of ground given how thin the book is, you can see. It is only 150 pages. So, overall, I'd say... If you are someone who is already super uh, knowledgeable of things in space, uh, the content of the book might not be exactly what you're looking for. If you're not that familiar with things in space, I think it's a wonderful book. It does actually cover some history things as well. Um, not just space. It does cover, like, 
um, history of discovery and uh, like a discovery of things in space, things along those lines. So it, it it's not just space. It does have some of those historical aspects in it. I do think it's very great if you don't read much about space. It's basically very digestible and very fun to look at the pictures. <laughs> Uh, I think that's kind of Neil deGrasse Tyson's thing when he writes, is making very digestible uh, books, which is appreciated, it, but obviously not for everyone. Overall, I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Near perfect, near perfect. The only reason I'm taking it, like, not to 10 out of 10, I mean, first of all, it's very hard for any book to be a 10 out of 10, right? The reason why I'm not giving it 10 out of 10 is because of the aspect of I don't think if you already have, uh, you know, extensive knowledge of space and stuff like that, astronomy, uh, that you would enjoy as much. And so I feel like because of that, I can't give it a perfect score. But a 9 out of 10 is extremely solid. <laughs> 9 out of 10 is a lot. Yeah, this is a high, high recommendation from me. I think if you like space, you'll like this. If you like space, but not enough that you, if you, if you like space, but don't like it enough to have already read a ton about it, this is a very good starting point if you want to learn about space. I guess that's what I should say. This is almost like the perfect starting point. The perfect starting point, but not really good for much else beyond that. Unless you just want to look at fun pictures and learn a little bit. I, I'd say, I'd say a 10 out of 10 for what it's for, a 9 out of 10 overall because I can see if I were someone who had known more about space, I can see the complaints. I can see the potential complaints. So that is the end of the uh, book review of Welcome to the Universe, a visual tour in 3D. Anyhow, all right, that's the end of book club.